Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Recon Stewart and we are continuing my series of advanced flight training qualifications by Maple Flag Missions. Uh, we're going to be repeating the same mission as last time, the air-to-air -air refueling, but this time it's going to be at night and in weather. So we will see you on the runway. Welcome, Stud. Start up your bird and meet me at the runway. Our departure time is 2200. Alright, so we need to update our time on targets for this mission. So let's go to a flight point. And we have MSN1, RVIP, RVCP. So. Let's go to waypoint MSN whoop, MSN one change it up here at uh, right LSK one and desired time is going to be twenty two oh four thirty. And then we'll change RVIP right here. And that's going to be 2208. 2223. Make sure I have that right. Twenty two twenty-three. Okay. So we've got that in position. Let's turn on flight point management and go to position. Ground speed, flight plan. One, rolling. Rotating. Gear up. Okay, one. We are up. Fly heading two four five, Angels eight, and maintain an appropriate speed. Zero, zero, maintain Angels 8 at an appropriate speed to reach the waypoint on time. Ooh, that was a big lightning flash. Two, three, two, three. Let's review the AAR procedure. RVIP, rendezvous initial point, contact the tanker to initiate the rendezvous. We need to be at the RVCP, rendezvous control point, at the RVCT, rendezvous control time, as briefed. We will be using RV Delta point parallel procedure. I'm sure you've studied the others, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Echo, Foxtrot, and Golf. RV Delta is typical for the A-10. If you ever fly combat air patrols, you will fly RV Echo, especially in MCON conditions. RV Delta requires you to maintain an agreed track and the tanker to maintain a reciprocal track. 
tanker will turn onto your track at the computed slant angle based on your speed and the RVCT. Once at the RVIP and you have made contact, then set up your TACAN to AATR to get range and bearing to the tanker. Then safe your switches, do a line check and your pre-contact checklist. Fly 1,000 feet below the tanker base altitude until we have visual. Once you have visual, contact the tanker for further instructions. Turn your TAC hand to AAREC so the tanker can get distance information from the next set of aircraft. If the tanker has chicks in tow, we will remain one nautical mile in the astern position. We will only approach once we confirm no AAR is in progress. Once the area is clear, I'll call clear astern, and you should slowly move into the pre-contact position. Okay, let's run through the AAR checklist. Master arm switch, safe. Gun pack switch, safe. Laser arm switch, safe. DSMS weapon status page, deselect. DSMS missile page, EO power, off. Now perform the line check. Air refueling door, check closed. Engine RPM, at least one engine core RPM minimum 85%. Air refueling line, check button, depress. You may see some fuel vent momentarily. If it persists, then we have a fuel system problem and you should abort the mission. Confirm ready light on within three minutes. If it does not come on, then we have a fuel system problem and you should abort the mission. Looking for our ready light here. There it is. Visual on the tanker. Contact the tanker so they know we have visual. Ready pre-contact. Ready, pre-contact. Return pre-contact. Remember to set your TACAN to AAREC so the tanker can get distance information from the next set of aircraft. Okay, clear astern. Let's run through the pre-contact checklist. Internal fuel quantity, check. TACAN, air to air receive. CMSP, standby. Refueling lights, on. Exterior lights, as required. Intercom monitor switch, as required. Hot mic switch, as required. Signal amplifier switch, norm. Fill disable switches, as required. Air refuel control, open. Confirm ready light on. Good, move closer to the tanker. When in the pre-contact position, call pre-contact. Ready pre-contact. Ready pre-contact. Clear contact. 
Alright, slow stick and throttle, slow stick and throttle. Make sure I'm trimmed up. Micro throttle adjustments. yourself stabilized a little ways back and then walk the throttles to creep up to the station keeping position. Do not exceed one or two knots of overtake. We lose a lot of booms that way. Contact. There you go. Contact. You're taking fuel. Well done. There's the first one. Contact. There you go. Contact. You're taking fuel. Well done. Number two. Okay, just need one more. Contact. There you go, contact. You're taking fuel. You disconnected too soon. That's for sure. Another attempt, stud. Remember, stabilize, walk the throttles, fly off the tanker, not the boom. Contact. There you go. Contact. You're taking fuel. Third one. See if I can stay connected for a while here. Yep. You can continue to practice your tanking or head for home. It's your choice, stud. How are we doing on fuel? Let's try another one here. That one's not going to last. You disconnected too soon. Try another attempt, stud. Remember, stabilize, walk the throttles, fly off the tanker, not the boom. There you 
Mexico, contact. You're seeking fuel. Well done. Break away here. We've got 9,300 pounds. I'd say that's good. Return free contact. Victor. Abort refuel. Fox one. Just a little Abort bit rejoin. more. A little bit of stick and throttle. up our Enough for today, stud. Let's run through the post AAR checklist. Air refuel control closed. Ready light off. Fuel quantity check. Intercom monitor switch as required. Hot mic switch as required. TACAN as required. Exterior lights as required. portion of our flight. Did you enjoy that stud? Hmm. It was alright, I suppose. You did well today. With practice, you will be able to keep station for much longer. and fly to waypoint 8 for our descent back to Cabuleti. My ILS is down and we are at minimum visibility. I suggest you divert to Batuba. You are clear to exit the MOA. Fox one. Atumi, Colt, one, one, request landing. Gear down. This is some god awful weather. Alright, there's my bottom horizontal needle. 
see if I can get these bad boys. Flaps down. Come on, line up. Line up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Having some difficulties. Altitude, altitude. They're lined up. They're lined up. And there is the runway. Wow, that is a hell of a crosswind. Two, try an arrow break. Two, RTB. Speed brakes out. Brakes on. Unbelievable. Oh my goodness. That crosswind was insane. I got a little bit... Uh, a little bit too slow there, but man, that is tough, tough to keep that was uh, ILS needles centered. You have two minutes to complete your shutdown procedure. Well, let's see how we did. Let me confirm your shutdown procedure. You missed a checklist item, cadet. You failed to turn off the EGI. You made it, stud. You passed this PO. You received a qualified minus rating. Work on your maneuvers to improve your skills. It may save your life. Return to Cabuleti for the next qualification mission. All right. We made it. That was hairy at best in all this weather, but uh, the air refueling went quite well. Uh, the landing and the shutdown procedure was a little rushed, so I need to improve that for next time. But I passed this mission, and we will move on to Advanced Flight Training Qualification Mission 3. This is Recon Stewart. We'll see you next time.